Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning in to this video. I'm going to try to be quick. So the essence of God is what we was talking about in a previous video. And so God wanted me to continue with the essence of God, but he's saying use my words. You need to use God's words, one, to know who you are and to have this shield of protection against you during this warfare. So God is saying, who are you? First of all, Jesus said, I am the light of the world, John chapter 8. And then he turned around in, in, in the book of Matthew and t tell us, you let your light shine beyond, you know, in the world, beyond this world. You, like Jesus, are the light of this world. He also tells us in Matthew chapter 5, you are the salt of the earth. You are the influence. You are the, the, the flavor. You are the chosen. You are the preference. preference. <laughs> um, you are a, a city that sits on top of a hill that can be hit, hidden. Everyone sees you. They know you. They know who you are. And, and, and it's, it's, take that and embrace that. You are the light of this world. Be the light in this world. Um, he also say his word is uh, Numbers 23, 23. He says in Numbers 23, 23 that no witchcraft, no enchantment, no divination, no curse can come against the children of Israel. Sit in that, understand that, use that as your shield of protection in this season. Nothing, none of that witchcraft stuff can come against you in this season. He say in Jude chapter 1 verse 9, through uh, the archangel Michael, um, while he was going back and, you know, going back and forth with Satan, he didn't go back and forth with him because Satan was trying to argue with him. He didn't give him the energy. He, he didn't get, give the enemy the ar argument he was looking for. And he simply said, the Lord rebuke thee. The Lord rebuke you, Satan. That was it. He used God's words to just shut him up and shut down Satan. Um, and the Lord, he, he continues to tell us, you are the, the, the head and you not the tail. You are the lender and you not the borrower. So God really wants us to get in his words and use his words in this season. The words will empower you. You have to know who you are. You have to know who you are. You have to know the power and authority that you have. And then use his words to protect and cover cover you from and during this warfare. So that's the word, you guys. You all have an amazing day. And I'll see you in the next video.